Now this. We have a company which says it's come up with a safe solution to dispose of unused prescription drugs, like opioids, for example. The man who leads the company is with us now. Uh, the, he, the company is Dispose RX, and this man, John Holliday, is the CEO. Okay, now what you've got is a product whereby you just add water and gel to opioids and they turn into nothing, right? Show me. Go ahead. Sure. Okay, we've got the... Uh, We've got pills in there in a little bottle. What do you do now? So added to the pills is the water, right. followed by a powder, right. which is the Disposer X product. Yeah. This so is that's actually, the product. The powder is the product. product. Yeah. You're adding it to the water and the opioids. That's correct. Not that they're opioids. It's vitamin yeah. D, I believe. <laughs> that's correct. <laughs> All right. Now you put the top on. And now what? Shake it for a few seconds vigorously. Yeah. And what you'll find is... You can't hear the pills rattling around after a while. That's true. That's because true. it's very rapidly forming into a gel from which they cannot be extracted for abuse. Oh, it's gone. And they won't pollute okay. the landfill. Now, you, so your product, Dispose RX, that's given free now at Walmart every time they put out an opioid mm. prescription. Is that correct? Exactly. So they had the vision to help treat their customers to a way of getting rid of these leftover drugs. 70% of the addictions and overdoses begin oh. with pills in the medicine cabinet. Yep. 190 people die a day from drug overdoses. So, now, in the old days, <laughs> a couple of weeks ago, if you got surplus opioids, you chucked them down the toilet. What's wrong with that? Well, it pollutes. So our efforts are not only to stop the cycle of addiction that begins in the medicine cabinet, but also the pollution. For instance, the fishes in the upper reaches of the Potomac have both sexes because of drugs that are flushed or taken and get into the waterways. Is that true? That's true. Good Lord. And also from the Librium and Valium that gets into the water, they don't school. So we pollute the water with drugs, and I don't recommend that we pollute it with the opioids or any of them. Oh, well said, sir. Yeah. Dispose RX is a private company? That's correct. You're the CEO? That's correct. You're a stakeholder in Dispose RX? I am. You made a ton of money? No. So far, we self funded, but we're looking forward. This is a passion of ours to stop this cycle of addiction. So we want to do well by doing good. John Holliday, I think you're all right. Dispose RX. Thanks for being with us this morning and the demonstration. We appreciate it. Sir. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you.